Hello viewers, today in my video I will be talking about the runs up runs down problem. In my earlier video I taught you about the algorithm, now this is the problem. So let us see how to solve a problem on runs up and runs down. So the problem says that following sequence of numbers are given. Now you have to use the runs up runs down with alpha as 0.05 and they have also given that alpha by 2 of 0.0525 is 1.96 so first step is to define the hypothesis that you can write from the algorithm next you have to write the sequence of RURD that is the runs up runs down so in the algorithm I have already mentioned that for runs up runs down the sequence is plus minus sequence so today I will teach you how to write those plus minus sequence so first you have to take the first number that is 0 0.12 you don't have to arrange these numbers let the numbers be in the same way they have given so first you have to choose the first number that is the 0 0.12 and you have to see which number is after that that is 0 0.01 now remember this 0 0.01 is very much less than 0 0.12 so in mind you can do the calculation like 0 0.01 minus 0 0.12 which leads to a negative value so you will write a negative to 0 0.12 and so you will write a minus next you will subtract 0 0.23 from 0 0.01 which is positive so a plus sign next 0 0.28 minus 0 0.23 which is again positive so write plus next is 0 0.89 minus 0 0.28 that is again a plus next 0 0.31 minus 0 0.89 which is a negative value so you will write a minus next 0 0.64 minus 0 0.31 is a positive value so you will write plus next is 0 0.28 minus 0 0.64 that is a negative value so you will write minus next is 0 0.33 minus 0 0.28 which is a positive value so you will write plus next again 0 0.93 minus 0 0.33 is a positive value so you will write plus now remember that you have 10 numbers but you will get a sequence of only 9 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 so after you do this you have to count the total number of runs that is the A now how will you count the total number of runs now this 1 negative is counted as 1 so this is 1 this sequence of plus is counted as 2 this is 3 this is 4 this is 5 and this is 6 so see the repetitive signs must be counted or taken as 1 so you will get the number of runs as 6 so that is a is equal to 6 next coming to computing the mean as well as the variance you will put the value of n that is 10 in this that is 2 into 10 minus 1 divided by 3 it comes out to be value of 6.33 and value of this that is 16 into 10 minus 29 upon 90 this turns out to be 1.45 so after that you have to calculate the test statistics that is the z0 so for that a that is 6 minus 6.33 divided by now you have to remember that you have to take the square root of this not this number this is sigma a square so you will have to write square root of 1.45 which leads to minus 0 0.27 now this is the value of z0 now after this they have given this threshold as 1.96 so final step is to compare that the z0 is lying between minus z alpha by 2 and plus z alpha by 2 so as you can see minus 0.27 lies between this range so we say that h0 is accepted and therefore the random numbers are independent of each other so this is how you solve a problem on runs up and runs down hope you enjoyed this video if you found this video helpful please hit the like button and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe Thanks for watching this video.